Christmas. Oh, okay. So we're about to open Christmas presents. That's Gavin's pile, so he definitely racked out this Christmas. I got my Christmas presents. We got Mr. Elf over here. That's, he's a little cranky because we only got four hours of sleep due to the dogs giving us a lovely night. I slept like a rock. Gavin loved his new bed, so that makes me happy. Okay. Woke, you want to go first? I woke up with like, all of the blankets off, and I was like, where am I? Oh, wait, <laughs> it's Christmas. That's awesome. Start. Yeah, just go for it. One. <sighs> I'm tired. Usually I rip open my presents, but I'm going to take some. To okay, never mind. I'm nah, rip just open. rip it. Or we might need scissors at some point. I'm just going <laughs> to. I honestly don't remember what's in each present. Whoa. Oh, yeah, some that's little phone. random little uh, stocking stuffers. Some sound peats. Lift. Let your ears decide. <laughs> and, these, and these are wireless. So you Ooh, can yeah. connect them. I have a really bad time with headphones that aren't wireless. Oh, perfect then. And this is a funny one. <laughs> perfect. I want to keep... Actually, you should probably keep the box. No, you can keep the box if you want. Well, you keep the box. Okay. I want to keep the ribbon. Okay. I have no idea what this is. Oh, you like them as well, Lucy? I know, they're good, yeah. huh? <laughs> what is it, babe? It's a white box with some pretty colors. Babe. It's a My Heritage DNA, so I can find out what the hell I am. <laughs> <Thank you>. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I'm excited to find out, too. Yeah, I want to find out, because that means I can find out what I am. <laughs> This. You guys, I'm being a bad blogger, but Gavin opened up some clothes. This sickness, I feel, ooh, it says, <laughs> it says naughty, irritated, angry, devious, annoyed, and merry. Yeah, I think you're the last one there. Oh, merry, man, merry, very merry. Why hungry on here? That's what <laughs> I oh, show them the Deadpool one, too, because it's pretty awesome. Deadpool? But wait, oh, that's the wrong side. <laughs> Deadpool. Nice. I was about to say, like, I thought it was two sided. I was like, Deadpool and Deadpool. <laughs> that would be cool if it was two sided, but. Um, also, we didn't vlog my reaction, but kind of freaked because I had no idea Chris was getting me this, and I'm so excited. I can't wait to use it. And he says it has a 1080 camera. What else, babe? You said it auto returns. Auto return, auto stabilizer. Pretty stinking oh, awesome. So guess what? You're gonna have some awesome aerial shot vlogging coming soon. Right. I wonder what this could be. You hmm. want all of them. What do you mean you wonder? <laughs> Gavin, don't ruin it. <laughs> oh, ooh la la. I have no idea what it is. It's a man thong. <laughs> Wait, what is it? It's a huge it's actually, it's the, the cologne I like, I think. I can open it. You think? He opens it and he's like, oh, actually it's not the cologne I like, but, oh, thanks, babe. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it is a man thong. Yeah. Oh, jeez, babe. <laughs> it's the big one, too, and this is a, like a travel spring one. Oh, nice. Thanks, babe. You're welcome. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Don't I, kiss my the subscribers. I, I totally forgot to show this. Oh. Ta-da. Gavin's going to be smelling fresh. Fresh as heck. Right, Gavin? For yep. once. Swag. For once. And he's got some comfy slippers we forgot to show you guys, comfy too. Comfy slippers and a lot of clothes. Yes, lots of fun clothes. Okay, yeah, get that other one open. So, I can't wait for him to open that one. Nurse, pass me the scalpel. The scalpel? <laughs> Oh, would you look at that? More awesome clothes. <laughs> Another hoodie. 
and some nice jeans some to nice style jeans. styling for school. I like those ones because it has the fade on the yeah. front. This one you have no idea. I think the next two you have, you don't know. I don't have any idea about any of this. Really? Well, this one, but. You, you kind of probably thought I was getting you cologne because we kept talking about it. I was hoping. I didn't expect yeah. anything. I know, babe. Oh, <laughs> uh, you're editing it and you have full control of what zooms in and zooms out. Yeah, so don't mess with me. <laughs> hey, I have nothing to hide. I'm a very beautiful man. That's right, Gavin. Oh, yeah, that matches my shirt. We can be twinsies. Is that the one from Express? Yeah. Christmassy, babe. <laughs> That's the one I wish that I had let you open yesterday. but And so cozy. Did you feel the inside of it? It's, it's like soft. You think it'll fit? I think so. Okay. I'll try it on later. The sad thing is, is that I know. <laughs> no. it, 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 it's oh, awesome. Look at all that purple in there. <laughs> Some purple. Oh, yeah. I like that. Like it, baby? Thank you. You're welcome. I knew you would like it. <laughs> all right, Gavin. Open the bag, for, bag first. What? And it's disguised as well, so you'll have no idea. <laughs> Let's make it yeah, please. <laughs> Careful. It's a phone. <laughs> Ooh, and an iPhone at that. And a silver shiny one. This package he thought was the iPhone. Yeah, I thought this was an iPhone. I knew Foils I was, again. I was, I was kind of suspicious because Dad was like. Sorry, Gavin, we can't get you an iPhone for Christmas. And Aww. I was like, something's up. He <laughs> was like, try not to break that phone for a while. And I'm just like, did you really say you that thing for so while? messed up? <laughs> yeah, my phone is like so close to me. I know, phone. you desperately needed a new one. But this is but why. Man, that's why you're. <laughs> This is why you got this present because it, Ooh, it will phone. always be on your phone, so you you'll never break about it again. The box as well. Yeah. Was like, I was like, "Can I just use Lexi's old phone case?" And he's like, "No, we're getting you an auto box. It's the good stuff." Yeah. So this has like a protection all the way around. So you're puppies get gifts too. Okay, just give one of each. They have a toy each. Got Santa, Santa for Lucy. <laughs> Rosie, come here. Okay, Rosie gets. <laughs> oh, Lucy, you're so mean. <laughs> here you go, Rosie. I'm just guessing it's honey bee Yeah. Uh, and then little treats. Wait, what is it? I didn't want you to know, so I left. <laughs> She's were, very I, I smart. I thought you would sit here and go, let me see. Melissa did the same thing. Yep. And you did sit here that night. I was you like, see? Oh, yeah. Keeping this bow. Fandor, come here and lie down. It's a heavy box. I wonder what it could be. Were you good this year? Yeah. Right. I have good grades. Ooh. A PlayStation. This is mine. No, <laughs> sharing is caring. This is ours. There you go. Going in my room. This is a family, so you guys have set. You excited? Yes. It, it, it comes with a video. Yeah, that was going handy. What's this that? Did that. you get the key yeah, thing too? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone got one of these, guys. This is the best, cool. this is the best wrap. Never lose your keys again. And look at this awesome gift mom B got. I wonder what it could be. Baby. Okay, so I am at the wheel for this one. Malil. Uh, Malil? Malil? Melissa <laughs> is opening a present. Oh, boy. The Grinch. The Grinch box. Be careful. Be careful. Oh. <laughs> so excited. I'm gonna cry. I'm so excited. So what is it, honey? Um, I'm gonna cry. 
I don't, I'm sorry. Um, it's the Hugh Jackman show. I get to go. <laughs> So excited. And there's a ticket for Chris. Thank you, Mom. I'm so excited. I really wanted to go so bad. I didn't think I was going to get to because it's really expensive. Thanks, Mom. You're welcome. I'll give you guys Come on. Oh, it's a shirt. Show them. What's the shirt I don't know. Oh, God. It's pink and it's really soft, so I like it. You got to open it for us. You can't read it. What, I can't see it? Yeah. What does it say? What does it say? Let me see. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> I thought I would get ready with you as I'm getting ready to go over Chris's parents' house for Christmas dinner. Um, we celebrated with my family yesterday. It was so much fun. And um, as you guys saw, um, we did open presents at my home first with Chris and like... Chris and Gavin and me opened our presents to each other first, and then we went over to my mom's and met my brother over there, too, and opened presents with the rest of the family. And then we're also, uh, oh, sorry, this is so bright. We're also going to open presents at his parents' house today with them, of course. Um, but, oh, my goodness, my family and Chris, everyone was just so, so um, generous, and I cried at my parents' gift to me. Um, they got me a few things which were just ridiculously generous. Like I showed you guys the Google Home and then the tickets to see. I don't know if you understood from me being so excited and crying, but um, I got tickets to see Hugh Jackman um, live in concert. Like he's going to be doing a tour for Greatest Showman and Les Mis. Like he's going to be touring and singing like songs from the shows. I'm just so so excited my brother got me tickets um i showed you the funny shirt but i didn't show you me unwrapping his other gift was tickets to see dancing with the stars live um i've never been to a dancing with the stars live i've always been to like those other um like i've been to Derek and julianne all of their concerts and i've been to um the chamarokarskis i'm gonna say their name wrong um you know you know who I'm talking about, the brothers. I've been to their um, concert, not their concert, you know what I mean, their performance twice, their two tours. And yeah, I'm so, so excited for that gift too. And um, Chris got me, I think I showed you guys, he got me some amazing gifts too. And I'm just so, so thankful and grateful because it really isn't about the presence. It is about spending time with family and, and just getting to enjoy the season and also cherish the true reason that we celebrate. Um, I mean, I don't want to get super religious here on my channel, but you guys know. So anyways, um, I just wanted, since I really didn't get to film that much, so I just wanted to cherish the moment, everyone opening their gifts. Mama B loved her gifts. Um, I ended up getting her like a Pandora charm, the Roquette one that ha comes in the ornaments. And then I got her this really nice soft shirt that the really nice soft ones from Old Navy that I love. Um, I got her one because she really loved mine, so I got her one, and then I also got her, I also got her this really awesome cookbook. Sorry, this is really bright. Um, I can't think of her name all of a sudden. Ugh, from Fixer Upper. Isn't that what their their show is called? I'm so sorry, guys. I'm totally blanking, but. The girl that does all the cute um, farmhouse decor and everything. Oh, it's going to drive me nuts that I can't think of it off the top of my tongue right now. But she was so excited about that cookbook. And um, to dis it was such a, it's such a nice coffee table book, too. And my dad, I got him a new wood watch because he actually broke the one I got him before and he loved it. So I got him that. And my brother just like... Um, a bunch of clothes and like a special ornament, which I'm not sure if I showed you guys, but it was um, to commemorate our trip to Europe. It was a London. It was like a glass blown ornament. It's really pretty. I liked it. He really liked it too. So um, I'm trying to think if I'm missing anything, but I know I didn't get to share those with you on the Vlogmas because I didn't want them to accidentally come across it and, and it ruined the surprise. So I'm just glad that everyone loved their gifts and that everyone was excited. I can't believe my mom got um, the family, the PS4 for Gavin, pretty much for Gavin and Chris, let's be real. Um, Gavin is like really crazy excited and I think so is Chris. Um, I think that's what it is, a PS4. It's the latest PlayStation. So yeah, just getting ready to go over to Chris's family. 
and I hope you guys had an amazing Christmas. All right, guys, I am all ready to head over to Chris's family's house for Christmas. Um, I just have these little snowflake earrings on. The dress that I have on is from Torrid. Um, it's kind of like a red, a pinkish red with um, black roses. And it's a little bit off the shoulder. And yeah, I really like it. It's very like flowy. And I think I am gonna wear some flats. I was, I really like wearing boots with dresses. I know, controversial, <laughs> but it's just so comfortable. But I think I am gonna wear flats today because I think they have us take off our shoes in their house. So it just makes more sense and easier to wear flats. So that's what I'm gonna wear. My lip is the Too Faced, um, Too Faced Holiday Lip and Candy Cane. I don't know if they sell it anymore though. I'm really sorry. It's one of my favorite red lipsticks. And let's get going. These are the sparkly flats I'm gonna wear. On top of the Christmas cookies I made, I am also bringing this Junior's Fabulous Cheesecake. Now we had one last night that Mama B did purchase both of these cheesecakes. Um, I'm bringing the cookies and my mom gave us this cheesecake to bring to Chris's parents' house, which was very sweet of her. And I look how beautiful this is. It's a red velvet cheesecake and this like pattern was made by Oz Isaac Misrahi and I think it's so beautiful <laughs> in my sparkly <laughs> sweatshirt from before and don't mind the lipstick all over my lips right now but I just got back from Christmas um, Christmas dinner and Christmas time with Chris's family I'm sorry I didn't vlog um, they're not super comfortable with it they're not used to it when it comes to me vlogging because I do it with my family but I just wouldn't expect to bring that out on them so I just vlogged like the food and they got me a ring cleaner, which I've been really wanting. It's actually an ultrasonic um, cleaner. It's the Branson 200. My ring is actually, see it's right there. It's actually cleaning in the background. I can't wait to see it. I really wanted this cleaner for the house because I want to keep my engagement ring nice and clean. I'll probably only do it every other week or so, but that is it for today. Um, I was gonna act like tomorrow's Vlogmas, but it's not. But this vlog will still go up on Sunday. It's so weird not posting every day, but I'll see you guys it's the next day. And I have all my presents out here on the table to put away. And I'm not gonna do a separate what I got for Christmas video like I've done in the past. So I just thought I'd show you guys a little bit of like what I got for Christmas from my parents and from Chris's parents. So first I'll just start off with with what Chris's parents got me was this Branson 200 ultrasonic cleaner that I showed you guys last night that cleaned my engagement ring and it did an amazing job. It is like sparkling like crazy. So I absolutely love that. And from Christina and Rick, which is, Rick is Chris's brother, um, cause my brother-in-law, they got us this candle, mint hot cocoa. Well, technically it's for me. Chris got a candle too, but it'll be for us cause for the house and it really, really does smell so chocolatey and minty it smells amazing speaking of that we gave me some peppermint bark and i've got these really beautiful little hair clips from lauren conrad collection also from the lauren conrad collection they got me these beautiful bracelets I've got some victoria's secret lotion this is in the crushed petals And these fun earrings. Also this really cute ring holder that has the Eiffel Tower with little lights all around it. It's so cute. This is also from the Lauren Conrad collection, I'm pretty sure. And then some Godiva chocolates. So yay, thank you guys so much. Okay, now on to what my parents got me and my brother got me. So first I have two little charms from Pandora that I need to put on my Christmas bracelet. So first we have this adorable little hot cocoa charm. Isn't that so cute? And then we have a Christmas Mickey and Minnie is on the other side. Hope you guys can see that.
And then Chris got me the AirPods that I wanted. I'm so excited. These are wireless headphones from Apple. And Mama Bee knew that he was getting them for me, so she got the silicone case to go over um, the AirPods. And so you just open it, and there they are. Oh, I'm so excited about those. Um, and you guys also know that Mama B got, and my dad got us the Google Home Hub. And I'm setting it up right now. And they also, oh, they also got us these smart sockets for it. Um, my mom got my brother, Chris, and I one of these um, insulated mugs that can hold hot or cold for 24 hours. Sorry guys for the different angle. This is not a very flattering angle. <laughs> but I wasn't feeling good. I had to stop for a second. I don't know. I've been feeling like really off today. Like dizzy, nauseous from my migraine. So moving on. So Mama B also got all of us these really cool smart keys. It's called Key Smart with Tile Smart Location. So you never lose your keys again as Bluetooth tracking. Holds up to 10 keys. LED flashlight, bottle opener, and it's expandable. So this is so cool. So she got my brother one, me one, Chris one, I think. Um, then my brother got me this hilarious shirt that says, World Okayest Sister. <laughs> it was a joke, but it was really funny. And then he also got me tickets to see Dancing with the Stars live. We're gonna go together. And the thing that I got emotional about yesterday was these amazing floor tickets to Hugh Jackman, the man in the music show, when he comes here in July. I'm so excited. And these are in March. So March and July. And then my dad got, my stepdad got me this really crazy gift. Um, it's an Oreo music box. And I know Gavin's gonna be super excited to play with this with me too. So here was what it looks like. When you open it up. The actual player, like the actual music player, looks like a box of Oreos. It's this right here. And then it comes with some Oreos too inside of here. So how you play the music, let's see if I, I think it's on the back. Oh no, here it is. How the instructions are is you have to put an Oreo cookie on the little turntable and turn the music box arm to the center of the Oreo cookie and music will begin playing. So we'll have to show this on the vlog and like see how that works out because that's so funny and crazy. And my parents also got me this Wi-Fi touchscreen photo frame and this is going to be for our wedding table so that we can have a bunch of, you know, pictures. Um, it's a white frame. I just wanted to show you guys it. it's a white digital frame So that'll be awesome to display at the wedding and then in our home later and then Chris also got me this awesome drone So I can take aerial shots and some awesome cool vlogging shots for you guys. It has a 1080 um, Camera on it so I can do all that. I'm so excited to test it out Okay, those are all the awesome things that I got for Christmas this year. I hope you guys enjoyed seeing. I'm sorry if I seem a little off. I just really feel super ugh, nauseous, and I hate that feeling. Got a naked tree and naked shelves. Taking all of the Christmas down. Here's some of it, and there's some of it. Got to package it all the way tomorrow. I'm not doing it tonight because, like you guys know, I wasn't feeling too good earlier, but I got a, a little bit of energy. So I decided to take down all the Christmas, put a little bit of like decor back in this room that's not Christmas. I might put out Valentine's Day kind of early, like in January again this year, cause it's just so naked in here. Like there's just not a lot of decor. <laughs> Hey guys, so it has been kind of a crazy last two days. I had some wild things happen to me. Um, I think I need to do a separate story time on it, but literally I was woken up at 6.30 in the morning to someone like ringing my doorbell repeatedly. And I don't pick up the door for anybody, especially, um, or I should say just anybody in the morning unless I know someone's coming to my house because I live alone and that's kind of scary. Soon that's going to be corrected this weekend. Chris, Chris and Gavin move in tomorrow. Um, and I'll of course vlog that. But anyways, I texted my mom. <coughs> So I texted my mom and Chris and asked them if they were at the front door because they were the only people that I would think of that were there that early. And they said, neither of them said 
that they were. They were like, no. My mom's like, do not pick up that door. And so I didn't. Um, and then I went and checked after and I saw blood, like splatters of blood all in the front of my doorway. Yeah. And that's all I'm going to tell you. <laughs> no, I will tell you that it, everything's safe. I'm totally safe. It wasn't a psychopath. It ended up being some poor, like I'm totally giving away the whole story, but I'm sure you still want to hear the whole story. <laughs> Maybe I'll do a story time, but, um, ended up being, um, an older gentleman that has dementia that didn't know where he was and he must've cut himself somehow, but he got blood all up my driveway and, and my neighbors. And he, there was a more to the story. Like he was trying to get into people's homes that it, it's kind of, it's scary. I know he was an older gentleman. I'm so glad that his family found him and I know he had dementia, but still very scary when someone's like bleeding all over your property and trying to get into your home. Um, and you have no idea what's going on. So luckily it all got handled, but it was very kind of scary and a crazy morning. Um, and Chris and I are getting all prepared for the move. I've still been selling furniture. He's, I've been selling furniture for him and he's been taking care of that too and getting all ready and tomorrow is the big move. It'll be pretty quick and not that complicated. At least this time around, our, our big move later will be a little bit more complicated and, and um, stressful, but this one's not and we probably will be done before the end of the day even, so. Um, yeah, so I'm just doing some last minute things today and getting ready. I started driving and just stopped. Like I'm at my community. I'm at a stop. Don't worry. People are very concerned about me vlogging in my car. I'm very safe. Believe me. Um, what is going on with my voice? Anyways, by the way, my earrings are from Anna Louise jewelry. Um, these aviators, I'm pretty sure I got at TJ Maxx. They're rose gold and white. I love them. My jacket is from Torrid. I love the details on the sleeves. Um, but anyways, the reason I stopped for a moment is because I forgot to tell you guys that Target Dollar Spot already has their Valentine's Day decor. I'm going to try and get up a video today because I did end up going to two Targets yesterday and I didn't, I didn't put it on this vlog because I'm putting it in a, in a separate video completely. Um, but I can't believe they already have Valentine's out. It's kind of almost like sad that it's already out, but I'm someone that love, love, loves Valentine's Day because I'm all about that pink and they always have the cutest, cutest, cutest decor um, at Valentine's Day. And let me tell you, Target Dollar Spot did not disappoint. So I'm going to have an Instagram picture up soon um, and the video. So be on the lookout for that. It's probably already up by the time that you're watching this. Hopefully um, I'm going to try to get it up today. So I thought I'd share with you guys a little bit of groceries that I did for the week for Chris, Gavin, and I. Um, Gavin's going to be home from school, so I plan to make a few things with him, like lunch. That's why I have some like lunch meat and tuna, and we have peanut butter and frozen pizza um, that we'll probably have for lunch. And then I have a lot of things already, like veggie burgers. Um, what are those? These beans. I'll show you guys. Um the mud, these lentils we're going to have. And that's why I got some rice. Um, so anyways, that's why we don't have like a lot of protein going on here. So I got some Dave's Killer Thin Slice, brought of bread, some potato hamburger buns for the veggie burgers that I'm going to make this week. Some unsweetened vanilla almond milk, some Parmesan cheese and syrup for pancakes this week um, that I'm going to probably do on Sunday. This I just is a replenishment. Some salsa. Hazelnut creamer because it's Chris's favorite. This is the natural bliss one. Some blackberries for me, honestly. They were only 88 cents, so. Some avocado, possibly avocado toast going on this week. Some bananas for smoothies, baby carrots. Some apples for snacks. Cheez-Its and Triscuits for snacks, like maybe cheese and crackers or whatever. Um, some rice, like I told you, I'm gonna be making those lentils with that some tuna, and then I got turkey, provolone, and yellow cheese. We're gonna make some grilled cheese and tomato soup at some point this week, so that's why I got that. Some salad mix for dinners. Um, this was on sale, it's my favorite popcorn, so I got some of that, and some chips for chips and salsa. And then I got some lean ground turkey meat. Might make some taco meat, I'm not really sure. So yeah, <laughs> that's what we go got going on this week. So I had a few things come in the mail 
and I just wanted to share with you real quick. So first I have the Amore Pacific Dual Nourishing Lip Serum. So it's obviously a serum for your lips that is um, infused with green tea seed oil, vintage green tea essence, and it says to shake well before use. I have used this twice so far. This is what it looks like. You can see the serum right there. Beautiful packaging. It has like a spongy pointed tip applicator. Let me try to do this without spilling it. As you can see, very comfortable on the lips. It feels really, really good. Um, probably my only complaint is that it does have a perfume um, type scent and taste to it. So you don't want to like accidentally lick your lips with this on because it does not taste good at all. <laughs> but it definitely is very hydrating, nourishing on the lips. And um, I've been using this in the morning when I'm doing my makeup. So definitely am enjoying that. I'll make sure to link that down below. Thank you to Octoly and Amore Pacific for sending this uh, for review purposes. Gavanchi also sent me this beautiful package. And when I saw how beautiful these were, I literally squealed. Look at how stunning that is. Oh my goodness. So beautiful. And here is the lipstick packaging. I'll show you the actual tube as well because it's just so pretty. Look at that. So beautiful. So here's some more information on it. Should be available at Sephora this month and January for at Barney's and Saks. And it's all about the Happy Lunar New Year. Beautiful. Also got a package from Influencer and L'Oreal Paris. So this is their Magic Root Precision. This is brand new. Temporary gray concealer for temple and scattered grays. So this is like a precision pen you can bring with you now in your purse. Um, I don't think I've used this Magic Root cover-up yet. Um, as you guys know, like I have some areas that are a little sparse after my accident and with my thyroid issues, I have some hair loss. And so I use stuff like this to cover like any areas that look a little sparse. Um, Right now I'm using the Gray Away one and one other brand, but I don't think I've ever used the L'Oreal. So I'm gonna give this a try. So thank you so much to them. So yes, I have the same jacket on <laughs> as yesterday, but today is move-in day. So exciting. So Chris is packing up his stuff into a trailer at his um, place in Phoenix. So he's like an hour away from where I live. And then when he gets here, we're gonna unpack his trailer um, with the things he needs here and then we're gonna go to my storage unit or it's I guess our storage unit um, And there's some boxes back there that I'm going to put in the storage unit and then he has some too um, And then we're gonna come back and unpack what he has and put everything nice and tidy away and Then we're officially moved in um, I did end up putting up a little bit of Valentine's decor today that I just the little bit that I have I really don't have a lot of Valentine's stuff, but I'll show you that in a second but here's the official key. So crazy. I've never given anyone a key to my house other than Sadie when she lived with me. Um, but yeah, it's really special. So I can't wait till okay, I get to So I'm going to show you a little bit of my Valentine's decor. So I've got my Google Home. Yes, I still have the sleeve over it. <laughs> and I got a candle burning. This is the winter candle from Bath & Body Works. This little table runner was at the dollar spot last year. And then this I found at TJ Maxx last year. It's from Cynthia Rowley. A little tray and then over here I have this heart from Target dollar spot this and that was from last year it's a glittery gradient XO and this is from this year this tray was from last year but they also have it this year something very similar kickstand and then this little jar is from this year at the dollar spot and this little guy was from last year at Target it wasn't at the dollar spot but it was in their little Valentine section isn't he so cute <laughs> Okay, and then I also, over here, I have this little sign on the door, and then I'm probably going to end up putting this tray away because it's obviously very Christmassy, but I forgot to put it away with my Christmas decor. I have my little sign that Emily got me. Um, we'll hang it in the new house, but I wanted to leave it out for now. And then I have this little jar was from the dollar spot, and then these little heart um, decorative items were from the, the what was it, Dollar Tree? 
um, Dollar Tree last year, but I'm sure they have something similar this year. I've got these little towels hanging on the fridge over here. Then I have my little coffee bar station. These are the macaron, the like Paris collection from Nespresso. And then this was from the dollar spot. And then I have some cinnamon and I think nutmeg back there to put on coffee. And this little made with love sign was from the dollar spot this year. And this actual little tier is from the dollar spot. If you haven't watched my haul, make sure to watch it. I'll link in down below because you'll see all of that. And I have this little sign was from Kirkland. That jar has more pods and espresso pods. And this was from Home Goods. And then of course I have my Nespresso. Oh, over here in this little cart too, I have some cute little napkins. And those are like brown sugar packets and then little like straws and little stir sticks that are in my living room. We're gonna take down the tree today. I took all the ornaments off, but Kristen needs to help me take it down. Um, these shelves are super Barry. because I packed everything and then I had Christmas decor all up on here, but I really don't have a lot of Valentine decor. So I have this cute little garland from last year that's all sparkly. I have that little XO sign and that little arrow, sparkly arrow. I need to take my little moosey down. <laughs> but those are the only Valentine's decor things in this room right now, at least. Um, here's what my living room looks like at the moment. Jar of candy within a little heart bowl. And then over here, I have another candle, my flower arrangement. And then this little tic-tac-toe board was from the dollar spot last year at Target as well. I'm having some avocado toast for lunch, waiting for Christelle. They're still in the process of um, bringing some stuff to donation and packing. And I'm about to start watching Netflix. I'm really not sure what I'm gonna watch though. Everyone's been talking about this show, Bird Box. I won't watch it without Chris though, because if it's a show, we'll probably watch it together. Oh, that's right, I was watching Fuller House. I'm gonna continue watching that, the new season. So, I kind of forgot to vlog us. <laughs> we just checked out the house and it's looking so good. So excited, is, right babe? This is my new roomie. Yeah. <laughs> with benefits. <laughs> roomie with benefits. Um, so we just finished going to the storage unit. Why are you laughing? You can't say that on the vlog. <laughs> yes, I can. They don't know what the benefits are. That's true. Cooking. I That's what I meant. I'm going to cook for him. I do laundry. Yeah. Anyways, we went to the storage unit, got all that taken care of. Now we got to go back and unbox the few boxes that we have for the kitchen and Chris's stuff. And hopefully, if Gavin's being good, if you're watching this, Gavin, I know you are. He said he was going to unpack his clothes, so we'll see if he did it or if he just watched Netflix this whole time we've been gone. <laughs> Chris does not have confidence. I'm trying to give him the benefit of the doubt. Okay. Yay, Gavin's here. And obviously, my babe is still, hey, honey, still please, here. Welcome to another vlog. Now, today <laughs> this we're is the end of the vlog. Place. End of the vlog, Gavin. We're about to go into our favorite revolving sushi place. And Gavin's Bye, first bees. time. Welcome to another end of video. It's killing me. It's killing me, small. Okay, so we got two of the Red Rock Roll because we know what's our favorite. Mine specifically. You like it too, babe, right? I love it. Yeah. I love it. I love it. I love it. <laughs> Fire roll, this was? Fire right? roll, yeah, we're gonna try that. Shrimp Nigeri. Nigeri. And spicy tuna. Tuna. All right, guys, we're hanging out over here, getting ready for bed. Well, we're probably gonna watch American Horror Story. Not this guy. I'm going to bed and watching my iPhone for like three hours. Three hours? I don't Almost sleep 10. till like 12 o'clock usually. But we're gonna, I'm gonna edit the vlog and get settled. But we're all pretty much all settled in, except for Gavin's room. The, his dresser is coming tomorrow, so we'll have all his stuff together tomorrow. But pretty much, that's pretty quick, huh? It was. My oh. room's not settled in, but I am. I mean, I got a bathrobe. I'm perfectly good. <laughs> okay, thank you guys so much for watching, and we'll see you next week. Bye. All of us, because they're going to be here forever. <laughs>